Right, this is the uh, video that deals with the software and um, either routing or milling with the SumPod. I'm going to start first off with amending one program. Because I made a mistake uh, when the first trial that I didn't account for both the calibration of the SumPod, which isn't bad, it's not that far out but also the part I was cutting out I need to take off the full width or diameter rather of the rotor part so right so I've already amended this one so if you accept that this is the model we then export it as an STL file desktop, yep, yeah, okay Right, there's two parts to that, that's the LCD cutout, but if I then go Sky and Forge, it's set up for milling and end mill. Load in the program that I want to show, that to have rather. It shouldn't take long to actually sort itself out because it's it's uh, quite a simple program really. Okay, and the orientation is right for the two holes and the slot. I do look a bit close, but we'll wait and see. Okay, so that's fine. So now that that has been done, that's the tool path. We want to see where it's all going to line. And although it's in this corner position, it should go straight across and do these parts here, two holes, slot, and then back. So that's fine. So we can close that down. We've now got the uh, title of the document, export G code. Okay, to G. New file. Open. Looking minus the LCT version to export G code. Look to see the G code is there. Open and we're ready to go.